Hey everyone, Ryan here. So today we have hit our first official trailer for the movie Bill and Ted's Face the Music. Well, it's not, it is a trailer, but it is a teaser at the same time. So that means it's excellent, dude. So with that being said, let's go ahead and start that trailer and check it out. <laughs> okay, here we, here we go. 25 years ago, you played a concert in front of the entire world. One month ago, you played in Barso, California for 40 people, most of whom were there for $2 taco night. Bill and Ted, what have you got to say for yourselves? Be excellent to each other and party on, dudes. <laughs> you were supposed to unite the world and save reality as we know it. We've spent our whole life trying to write the song that will unite the world. Why can't we just go to the future when we have written it? Whoa! And take it from ourselves! But isn't that stealing? How is that stealing if we're stealing it from ourselves, dude? <laughs> Oh my gosh. No way. How'd you like our song? It's a little on the dark side, but you know, that's cool. <laughs> there we have it. Our first official trailer, teaser trailer that is for Bill and Ted Face the Music. And I gotta say, this is a nice little setup since uh, they didn't really give us too much as it is. We still have a couple more months because this movie is set to be released in August. And you guys can remember, it's this movie's actually been 29 years in the making. The last one they made, which is Bogus Journey, was 1991. And Excellent Adventure, excellent, was 89. I can't believe how old this um, franchise is. And so you can actually tell since the movie started in 1989. There you go. We have our 30 year, what is that? 80, actually 31, sorry. I was going to say 30 years. Well, it's over 30 years. It's 31, believe it or not. That's hard to believe. It's, this time goes by fast, seriously. And that's what's going to happen in this movie because they're going to actually go to the future once again. They kind of did it when I think about it in Bogus Journey because they, at the end of the movie, they still couldn't know how to play since it was their group called uh, Wallace Stallions. They still couldn't have that good beat of music in it. So in the last movie, Bogus Journey, they, they did, still went fast forward in time uh, to pick up them all themselves to come back and play for the big concert group at the school. Classic. <laughs> now, I can't wait to see what they actually deliver with, with uh, this bass, the music one. I can imagine the same thing kind of happens for what we see. They don't, don't want copyright issues, of course, and they don't want to cop copyright them all themselves with their music. That's kind of funny, I gotta say. <laughs> and if you think you guys going to happen to catch it, too, because uh, towards that last clip in this trailer, they met them all themselves. Oh, so I wonder if there's a uh, multiple universes uh, with this movie, and uh, because it kind you kind of get that idea, don't you? Because uh, the, the guys in prison uh, that we saw at the end of that trailer was actually the both of them, and uh, one of them had excellent. I, I can I, I need to go back now to really check to see what uh, the other one I wrote, but uh, th that was Bill and Ted. <laughs> that was pretty funny. I gotta admit they did a really good job with this trailer. And uh, speaking of that, too, because uh, Rufus, believe it or not, uh, passed away a while back ago, uh, George uh, Carlin. And I really hope they really give a really good uh, tribute to him. Because if uh, let me just focus on Rob, Robin Williams for a minute. Because if you guys remember, he was in uh, that Jumanji movie uh, a couple years back. Uh, they actually uh, rebooted uh, the series of Jumanji. And they gave a nice little tribute for him in that movie. And I hope they can do the same thing with uh, putting uh, George somewhere in this movie. Uh, Rufus it was a big big part of this movie he's the one that started it all he was the one in that film booth in the first movie and came down by a 7-eleven while they were both uh bill and ted were trying to figure out where in time uh they were working on their history project in other words they're trying to figure out that uh, stuff and they asked a rufus a question and he said how would you like to ask them themselves <laughs> this is where I liked uh, this uh, series a lot, especially Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, because they were able to go back in time, bring all those uh, historical people back into our present time and give a nice little speech. While other people in the crowd probably don't even know that, they just probably think these people are distressed for the fun of it. No, but these are people from our past time, believe it or not. Abraham Lincoln with that really equal speech. Party on, nudes! <laughs> so this has been a really good franchise. I'm really excited to see this trailer. 
Uh, yes, it's silly, but that's spell and Ted for you. These movies have been really uh, excellent. And I uh, was speaking of that too, speaking of Bogus Journey, I talked so much about Excellent Adventure, but not too much of Bogus Journey. Bogus Journey was uh, really, uh, really a bogus movie. No, it was a really good movie in other words, but Death is Coming Back. Did you happen, guys happen to catch that in the this as well? So I wonder how everything's going to intervene with everything with uh, Death Coming Back. Uh, we don't have much of a story from uh, what we've seen from the tra this trailer, but we, we know the idea outside of the box. If you guys uh, already have a prim somewhat of a premise idea, because I've, the daughters of Bill and Ted's are, will be a main focus of this movie. This is not, and we kind of saw them towards the end of Bo Bogus Journeys as well too, because they had uh, babies. Uh, when they went for the future time and brought themselves back, they had their girlfriends, of course, uh, their wives, in other words, and they had kids on the back of their backs. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> so this is all set up for face the music. I'm really excited. 29 years later, and we are getting another Bill and Ted movie. So that's excellent, dude. Bogus. 69, dude. <laughs> so I will can, can continue on with this, but I'm not gonna. And so I'm gonna start wrapping this up and say, my name's Ryan Crutch. Thank you for watching. Make sure to give him the thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.